Hello guys and welcome back to TechWolf. Today we are going to discuss check this command. Check this command is used to repair your disk hard drives or SSDs. And there is a falsy assumption that check this command can be used only on HDDs. However, check this command can be used for both HDD and SSD drives. For SSDs you might want to use a specialized tools or utilities from the SSD manufacturer for better results and performance management. So let's talk about what is check this command and before we even start let's open a command prompt to use the check this command you need to use a command prompt in administrator mode click on search and type in command prompt you will see first icon command prompt right click on it and click on run as administrator let's first discuss what is check this command check this command in windows is a powerful tool used to check the integrity of your file system and fix any logical file system errors that it finds. It can be particularly useful if you are experiencing issues such as slow computer or errors when trying to open files. Then you would run check this command and there are different flags or different attributes which you can use with check this command. Let's first open a file explorer and let's go to our disk as you can see. I have here Windows C and if I would just want to check disk without fixing errors type in a command check disk space and click on C and call this would only check my disk for errors without fixing these errors. Click on enter and let's run this command. And here you can see that it straight away notice the type of the file system is NTFS, which we discussed in previous tutorials. Then you see volume label is Windows. And here is warning F parameter not specified. We will talk about what is F parameter also in a second. And here you can see running check disk in read only mode. This means that it is checking only disk. If you are typing check disk and you are specifying which disk you would want to check. Here you can also see stage one examining disk file system structure, how many file records it has found. And once this checking is done, you can see more information where you see kilobytes, total disk space, a kilobytes in files and kilobytes indexed and main sector which says zero kilobytes in bad sectors. This means that you don't really have any bad sectors on your disk. You can see how many kilobytes used by the system and much more information. To check a disk and fix errors, you would type a command check disk then space and then you specify the drive which for which you would want to fix errors. I will not be doing it as it will take some time but with this command you also need to use a parameter forward slash and F and hit enter and if you would run this command this would not only check but also would fix errors on your disk which you have selected here. And here is another command if you would want to check for bad sectors and recover readable information you would type in instead of F R and if you have checked your disk and if you had any errors and you fixed your errors or if you run a command check disk with forward slash r to check for bad sectors and recover readable information you would also need to restart your computer for these changes to take place. 